In this week's video we have a look at five different types of radiologists. So here's what's gonna happen. I'll show you a case and then I'll show you five different kinds of radiologists that are dealing with this case and what they think and what they actually write in their report. So that's the case here. We have a patient with a knee radiograph and you can see we have several findings. The most important one being a severe osteoarthrosis of the femoral patellar compartment as you can clearly see here and the patient had really um, a lot of symptoms there and they decided to do surgery. Then we have other findings here this intracartilaginous osteophyte and some sclerotic lesion here, most likely a enchondroma or some kind of chondrogenic lesion. This is how it looks like after surgery and the radiograph was taken only a few days after surgery and the time delay between this one and the first image was only two months. And you can clearly see they did a replacement of the femoral patellar compartment. We have the normal postoperative changes and the rest remains the same, but suddenly our lesion here looks kind of different. Let me just show you this next to each other. So remember, it's only two months time delay and the surgery was just this uh, replacement of the femoral patellar compartment. Now let's see what our five radiologists have to say. <laughs> First, postoperative radiograph after femoral patellar joint replacement, period, normal articulation, comma, normal postoperative soft tissue changes, period, iotrogenic fragmentation of the enchondroma during surgery with migration of fragments along the medullary cavity, period. First postoperative radiograph after femoral patellar joint replacement period, position of components unremarkable period, normal postoperative soft tissue changes period. Oh gosh, what's that? Why has it changed? Hmm, damn it. All right, let's see. Um, compared to the preoperative image, comma, marked alterations of the previously sclerotic bone lesion in the distal femur period, no clear fracture visible. The sclerotic lesion appears bigger, comma, but has less sclerosis in general period. Several differential diagnoses are plausible period, extensive progressive bone infarction, comma, maybe even before surgery already. Comma, or it could be a bone infection with osteolysis of the previous sclerotic components, period. Or it could be an aggressive bone tumor which showed extensive growth during the last two months, period. In addition, comma, I cannot exclude an iatrogenic component by the surgeon. A biopsy, question mark. It looks like it is the same leg of the same patient, comma, at least I can rule out that. Period. To further investigate that strange behavior, I recommend CT and MRI, as well as a follow-up in six weeks to rule out further progression. Period. Now that was a really smart report. First post-operative radiograph of the femoral patellar joint replacement period, normal articulations, comma, normal post-operative soft, change, soft tissue changes, period. Fragmentation of the sclerotic lesion in the distal femur with migration of fragments along the medullary cavity, period, most likely during surgery. Let me have a look whether we have the surgical report. Oh, it's not written yet. Damn it. Hmm. What could that be? So most likely it's just two months. So the surgeon probably did something during surgery, but normally with this kind of surgery, why should he go up there? That's strange. Let's have a look in the literature whether this is written somewhere as a complication of anything. No, nothing there. Hmm. All right, so let's see. Um, Most likely iotrogenic during surgery. P 
period comparison with surgical notes recommended period First post-operative radiograph after femoral patellar joint replacement, period normal articulation, comma normal post-operative soft tissue changes, period speckled sclerotic lesion in the distal femur, comma different aspect and larger than preoperatively, period. That was an easy case. First post-operative radiograph after femoral patellar joint replacement period, normal articulations, comma, normal post-operative soft tissue changes, period. What about that sclerotic lesion? Hmm, it's different. Damn it. Well, I'll leave it out. Surgeon doesn't realize it anyways. What kind of radiologist are you? Or you, maybe you know people that fall in these different categories. Let me know in the comments below and also let me know what you think of the case itself. If you liked the video, hit the like button and also make sure to subscribe right now. And if you want to support me on a more personal level, go over to my Patreon page. You'll find the link in the description down below. That's it for this week. Enjoy Arsene if you're in Chicago and all the other people have a good week and see you next time.